I'm Brittany Lewis with Forbes Breaking News. A jury in Fairfax, Virginia ruled Wednesday that Amber Heard defamed Johnny Depp in a 2018 op-ed she wrote. In that op-ed, she described herself as a, quote, public victim representing domestic abuse. This decision comes after a six-week trial in a lawsuit brought by her ex-husband gripped the attention of millions. The jury also ruled for Heard in one portion of her countersuit. The jury deliberated for less than two full days before deciding that the claims made by Heard in her Washington Post op-ed were false and defamed Depp. Depp was awarded $10 million in compensatory damages and $5 million in punitive damages, but the judge capped the latter award to $350,000 in line with state law. Heard won part of her $100 million countersuit over statements made by Depp's representative calling her claims of abuse a hoax. She was awarded $2 million in compensatory damages and no punitive damages. The jury found her statements in her op-ed met all of the qualifications for defamation, including that she acted with actual malice and that her statements were made about Depp even though she didn't name him. Heard said in a statement to Forbes, quote, The disappointment I feel today is beyond words. I'm heartbroken that the amount of evidence still was not enough to stand up to the disproportionate power, influence, and sway of my ex-husband.